with a potentially emotional parting in the last episode, and the future of the group seems uncertain. All we know for a fact is, with the harbinger of death herself missing, things are going to be interesting. Ultimately, there's not a lot that I really want to add at the beginning, so... Shall we just watch the episode? Yes, we shall. A nice snowfall to remind you of all of the... Uh... You're just going to skip ahead a few months. But has he grown as a person? Or oh, zombie? So what is the uh, the plan after several months of nothing coming to fruition? If uh, the original zombie had his way, then I don't see why they would even still be in the remote area. And what is the uh, overall goal for him, other than just reobtaining you? I'm also surprised there hasn't been any megalo attacks. Kind of like the. There's an ever existent presence of danger due to Megalo, and yet. There isn't. Almost ever. Considering all the things that have been put on display so far, nothing seems. tense at all. How and what? How do you get attacked by laundry? Hubbard? Sure, but is it? It's a bit of a simple meal, is it not? Do the ninjas have a better information structure where they can learn things? And looks like you've been through hell. Okay. So she's been... I can't remember the word, what it would be, but it's communicated by her clan. Uh, 
there wasn't any insults thrown away around. Do they have a tight budget where they can't afford heating or hot water? Do I'm not sure you can eat. Why would... Huh? A Stradivarius. Who would confuse spaghetti with a Stradivarius? I what? <laughs> uh, from what I've heard, quite expensive. So why did this arrive? But she's playing it anyway. I was expecting there to be another joke. But no, she can actually play. And does he spend many of his days sat in front of the convenience store so he's helpful why have you decided to make this meeting in this occasion hang on why do why do animals love me then huh At least someone is a slightly up to up to date on what's going on. Who's the uh, weakest of this group, and yet who's also the most eager to f jump in? What is going on? Quite nice there, particle effect. Yeah, he's doing just fine. I don't think he's going to be too worried about that, but... Oh, so he doesn't have a... have a pin on her location at the minute. 
So having her around puts her friends in danger. Not having her have around puts her friends in danger. I think that there's a common denominator among those two. Because there's only one of them there who actively makes things more difficult. Is this the other ninja? More than one. <sighs> oh, there's quite a few of them. Is that guinea pig any anything to take note of as well? Then do it yourself. Why do you have to drag everyone else into your delusions? But you're just gluing his legs back on. At least something that would dissolve. Oh. I thought they were all part of her ninja clan, not Seraphins. Are, are they at least stuck on the right white ray round, with his feet facing forward? Called it! Walking will be slightly difficult, but... Well, you have to leave on this search immediately? An aquarium? I know he has a thing for animals, but... Ah, you got your legs on the right way around this time. He's like the neighbour. <laughs> Still under the uh, cultural um, marriage deal, isn't it? And she's just sat out front. And uh, probably overhearing this discussion. (laughs) 
So that's why his uh, base of operations was in the neighbourhood, so he can keep track. Are you seriously just going to wander off and leave her there? Okay, well, at least that's something, but that's... She could heal things by taking it on herself, couldn't she? So... Did she turn her as well? Is she now a ninja vampire zombie? Or a zombie ninja vampire? Or zombie vampire ninja? Or any configuration of those three words? Taking along a weapon, at least. I like how they're heading into battle, and yet it looks like he's serving up for a dinner party. and leaving the door open. Why is it spaghetti? That was quick. Have you forgotten why you're here? He goes through stages of being hospitable and yet not. He hasn't had that much of a breaking in period, has he? It's not like he's had to spend centuries so far. <laughs> and Haran is just still munching her along, isn't she? And why does he want to confine her so much? Was that in the food? So you're going full Saw, are you? Putting a trap on her head. So, what is he? Does um, Ayumu have the ability to?
manifest some sort of power. Oh, we're getting the... What is it? Adam? Is that what the artwork is? And considering you had the uh, ambush on him, no one actually did anything, even if they were you know, affected by his black mist. Why did it just... So it's like a game of hot potato with a bomb. <laughs> <clears throat> Are there any Are there any uh, rules as to get it to swap? Which wires? Okay, that was just a guess. <sighs> mm, getting things to work through sheer brute force. Oh dear. Big boom. He's taking it away himself. I wonder if his uh, immortal body would withstand being reduced to its atomic state. Ah, Aimu has uh, gained the ability to counteract gravity, it seems. How high did he jump? The perspective is all over the place. Him managing to get that high from a simple jump out of the window. We've seen it before when you're taking out the whale, but it's not like you uh, look like you put an excessive amount of force into it. But does you have a plan up a sleeve as to solving things? I don't see her thought process at the minute. Like knowing that there's a bomb left with them and not doing anything to assist. Kind of... It's really weird with her character. Is there a reason why this original zombie is so combative? And uh, quick to... Well, jump to quite severe.
It's like the lactose intolerant milk, mega milk thing all over again. Apart from having some sort of Stockholm Syndrome and emotionally blackmailed into it, until I get a bit more information as to the thought processes, and is the clan of the vampire ninjas going to avert their gaze, look the other way, and ignore the the crimes of Seraphin? She doesn't have um, much right to call Ayumu an insect anymore. Who designed that bomb, anyway? It was, seems too cutesy to have been that zombie guy. Is there a factory or, and company in the city that is developing dangerous toys for children? I'm sure that would be a very booming business. I'll reflect on my actions. I'm sorry. But if you've enjoyed the episode, please let me know by liking the video and or leaving a comment down below. If you want to make sure that you don't miss anything in the future, then subscribing to the channel and doing the notification bell would work for you. You might want to get some rest so that I can see you in the next one. I really do want to thank each of my Patreons for at least helping me keep the lights on. And so, to all of you, and Floor to Taku, Sal, Raywin, Denimed1997, and Luis Almanza, once again, thank you.